So, media. As you know, uh, media plays an important role of what we do. And it's very important to make the community aware of the people that we value. It is for an individual organization, including television, radio, that is committed to educating the public on mental health awareness and stigma reduction. We would like to acknowledge the three nominees that are with us this evening. Reggie Davis, Hot 105.1 radio personality, My Health Michigan, and Brenda Perryman, WHPR TV 33. And the winner is, is this it? Miss Mexico. <laughs> Wait, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> Media Organization of the Year, My Healthy Minds, Michael Hunter. Um, let's give a hand to all of the people that we serve in our capacity as mental health professionals. Yeah. Um, it is such an honor to stand here. I'm really humbled by the nomination. I'm humbled by being able to be a part of such a wonderful group of people. I tell everyone everywhere I go that I believe it takes a divine calling to do what you do on the front lines every day to stay entrenched behind the scenes and behind the curtains. And they don't have to spell your name right. But we know that we're making a difference. It's like being a farmer and we're just planting the seed and somebody else may come along and cultivate it. Somebody may come along and prune it. But every one of us play an integral part. And we feel very, very, very privileged to be able to have My Healthy Mind be a catalyst for some of that. And it takes the support of even people behind us. So we got our sponsors. Team Wellness Center has been really, really wonderful to us. TV20 has been wonderful to us. Detroit Wayne has been wonderful to us. Lieutenant Governor has been wonderful to us. The judges, all of our guests, all of the triumphant stories that we've had. And absolutely positively, my co-host, Elizabeth Atkins. And, and we just really, really are humble. And then with all the hours you put in, because I know we all do, then we have people like my wife and kids at home that really, really support us and hold us up when we get when our arms are tired. But we keep on keeping on. And so thank you for all of the people that we serve and for serving them with us. We're so honored because we know there's a tremendous stigma that you all deal with every single day. And we are delighted and honored to shine a spotlight on these issues. Our motto is let's talk about it because in order to heal and connect with the resources that can help people, we have to talk about it. So that's what Michael and I do every single week. We thank you for your support and we're especially grateful to CEO of Team Wellness Center, Tony Policella, and our producer, Millie Elston, for backing us and doing a phenomenal job on our show every single week. So thank you, all of you, for your wonderful support, and thank you, NAMI. <laughs>